first things first, although these are going to be very, very cheap, you can save 10% more in your eShop credit over at switchup.gg. Using code SWITCHUP, you'll get 5% off instantly and you'll get 5% back in coins, which can be redeemed whenever you want. That is for the month of July. Right off the bat, this is a sponsored video. If you want to win any of the games you're about to see, just leave a comment about that particular game. Cubic have their big summer sales starting and we'll pop a link to the website that shows all of the sales. That'll be in the description. There are a few familiar faces that Cubic want us to talk about and then we'll take the opportunity to choose our own picks. All the prices you'll see at the bottom of your screen. What have we got in the Cubic summer sale? Well, let's find out. Alright, before we properly start, we have Aeroblast, which is Cubic's new release, which describes itself as a waifu dating sim cum puzzler. It's essentially a match-free puzzler. Then much more our speed is Johnny Trigger the Definitive Edition, which is 60% off, and that sale will start on the 15th of July. This one's actually a fun little game, very fast-paced, proper old-school arcade, really, and just non-stop shooting, as the uh, title suggests. Currently at 70% off, we've got Alchemist Simulator, which places you in the role of a novice student of the alchemical arts, where you take over a studio from a famous relative and you have to create different recipes and gradually build up your repertoire. I actually quite like this concept. I played another game recently that was a similar idea, but it was like a side-scrolling 2D perspective where you built up your own alchemist shop. Dig Deep is also still on their sale and I think that's about 60 to 70% off. And it's like a party game. You have to go down, dig up gems. You can hire workers so that you can play idly and use different power-ups and speed-ups to mine. It is a fun little game, but it did need a little patch. I have to get it re-downloaded and see if it's all patched up. Also in the summer sale we have a maze which is quite self-explanatory really. It's like an arcade maze game. You've basically got to colour the map to fill it out to complete those maze puzzles. Sounds easy enough but they do get flipping hard and there's tons of them. It has classic mode, rush mode and also a two-player mode which is uh, quite fun. A decent little loading game if you're after something to pick up and play. That one's 60% off. Then we've got two more before our own personal picks and it would not be a cubic game sale if they did not ask us to talk about Run, Sausage, Run. If you woke up this morning and thought, I know what I need in my life, I need to get seven of my mates, sit down in front of a load of sausages, choose the tasty ch sausage of my choice, like for example, a big Savaloy, and then run, quite literally for my life, trying to avoid getting sliced, chopped or burned, then this is the game for you. Now I have to say, this is actually a fun game, if you've got a group of you to play it. I've also got a lot of time for anything that has different varieties of Savaloy in it. And for 89 pence, which is in itself not enough to buy one, that's not too shabby. All right, which takes us on to the last of the sponsored choices, and you know what it is. This is a cubic sales games video what's coming up next oh yes it's real boxing too but it is down to 89p now i was watching a documentary today about michael jackson who if you didn't know voiced his character in ready to rumble boxing back in the day and if you listen to that vocal it's really deep so they have a speculation that that was his true voice anyway i digress real boxing too well it kind of reminds me of it lets you create your own boxer and then lead them through the career there are different boss fights as well as a few mini games thrown in for good measure so if you want to get your balboa on then consider spending 89 pence on real boxing too all righty then so the first of my choices and a game i absolutely love is blade of darkness or better known in the uk at least as severance this is an excellent game now regardless of what you think it looks like if you think the visuals don't look great it's outstanding you can choose one of three different adventurers and they each have a different weapon and play style now the thing that made this so beautiful is the visceral decapitation that can take place depending on which direction you press the left stick and then when you swing your sword it will swing it in that direction so you can cut across up and down and you will have to look at the way the enemies attack and then block accordingly and there is nothing quite as satisfying as slicing off a leg and watching them hop around or an arm and, and I know that makes me sound slightly disturbed but as a <laughs> well I probably shouldn't say as a kid but as uh, someone that was definitely 18 when I first played this it was just awesome and having gone back to play it again it's just as good as I remember it really is worth the asking price at the moment it's about four quid or your regional equivalent then you've got good night night which i didn't mind at all even though it's quite short i love that 16-bit style you've got skill-based combat which is always nice to see in this style of game and you can play it in co-op now there are actually some stealth elements believe it or not you can sneak around you can look around corners and there's a fair old bit of loot to go and find now as you advance through the campaign your progress is constantly saved and there is an iron man mode in here as well i seem to remember them saying they were going to add some more content onto this one for the one person who hasn't yet purchased a carne just just 
just do it. It's so much fun. It's a one button hit, one button kill. You've got the right stick that controls your pistol and you just switch between shooting people with a pistol and then hitting them with the katana. Now it's super simplistic. It has a brilliant soundtrack and at 89p, if you've got your Cubic Games collection together, you should definitely have this one within it. Tools Up is also a very good game and it's essentially a house moving game where you're playing with a, a group of you in co-op. Now moving house is said to be the most stressful thing ever and playing in co-op with your, uh, your better half trying to move house is one of the most stressful things ever there is a demo of this one if you want to go check it out i would highly recommend it and then if it does tickle your fancy you can grab it on sale at three pounds 59 or your regional equivalent if you're after a classic roguelite then consider blazing beaks that one's one quid or one pound 34 and it features a load of different birds and a two-player co-op mode as well what's cool about this one is you take on negative traits and if you can reach the shop you can then sell those and get positive ones very fun little one this i really do like that art style and there's a four player versus mode if you've got four friends well uh, hopefully you've got four friends but if you've got four friends that want to play against you absolutely do consider getting a rise a simple story the definitive edition this one's down 75 percent to four pound 49 or your regional equivalent and it's great it is really good i mentioned it the other day it kind of reminded me of old man's journey it's all about love and loss and it's another that you can invite a second player to join you you can manipulate time to help you solve the puzzles and you will definitely have a lump in your throat by the end of it that's a guarantee something totally different is Neodori Forever. That's 68% off down to £1.44 and it's an old school racer, like the old arcade Outrun style games. It has five different game modes, Odyssey where you race in each world zone to reach the finish line, Night Mode which sees you battling against the Mafia, Endless Drive, well, self-explanatory isn't it really, <laughs> Rival Rush and Zen Mode. There are 25 different cars to unlock, in fact there may be even more than that, 11 different tracks and a lovely little synth wave soundtrack. I think we might actually have a few more codes for this one to give away as well. Last but not least, we have Chex Quest HD, which I had to mention because I, it was uh, something I'd learned when we first did a, a Cubic Games video that featured this game, and that was this was based on an old serial. And I think this is based, the actual game, on a 1996 first-person shooter adventure. You can play solo or with up to four of you, and it's all set on the remote planet of Bazoic. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> that name. You're trying to free galactic citizens from the evil cereal eating flemoids. Flemoids, man. Who thinks of this stuff? Now, there are a load of other games on sale, but those last ones there, or the second half, I should say, are the choices that I would make. Things like Mana Spark are on there as well. I do love that game, so that's the one to consider. But go and check out the link to the website that will give you the full details and just let me know which of the games you like the most. And let's just give away a ton of codes. A massive thanks to Cubic Games for them sponsoring us. It's sponsorships that keep us going we have no big company behind the scenes and we try and make it very clear and as transparent as we can when we do any kind of sponsored content okay right what do i need to say now i need to say thank you very much to our patreons and our members and to all of you if you want to save yourself 10 percent on your eShop credit you can get five percent cash back instantly using code switch up over at switchup.gg and you'll also get five percent back in coins and that is for the month of july for all things switch all the time keep it switch up cheers guys see ya